between SpaceX and its rival Blue Origin. Yeah, chalk it up as a win for Jeff Bezos' company. Blue Origin has launched a rocket, and then the really tricky part, landing part of that rocket back on Earth. Here's ABC's Sophie Flay. This morning, the modern space race heating up. The Jeff Bezos company, Blue Origin, achieving a major milestone, launching its new Glenn rocket into orbit, then safely landing its booster stage. It's a crucial step toward drastically reducing the cost of launching to space. We're in the game. We have a reusable booster, and this is just the beginning. For nearly a decade, Elon Musk's company SpaceX has been the only company capable of this feat. It's dominated the private space launch market with hundreds of flights of its Falcon 9 rocket. But now it looks like SpaceX finally has some competition. A new day, a new chapter has just opened for, as we said, Blue Origin, but also the space industry. Bezos seen celebrating in the control room, hugging fellow staffers. Praise pouring in from NASA, but also from the competition. Elon Musk tweeting his congratulations. The launch not only marking a turning point for Blue Origin, but also a critical step in NASA's plan to send people to Mars. The new Glenn rocket is carrying twin NASA spacecraft called Escapade. The two identical probes are headed to Mars to study the atmosphere. Escapade will also help us prepare to send human explorers to the Red Planet. For example, Escapade will give scientists more details about Mars's upper atmosphere that future astronauts will use to send radio and navigation signals around the planet. With this success under its belt, experts say Blue Origin could now secure more contracts and chip away at the dominance of SpaceX. Sophie Flay, ABC News, New York.